Let's now bring you some updates from the auto industry. The road ahead looks bumpy for Germany's once thriving auto industry. The coronavirus pandemic has dented the economic prospects of some of the biggest and most well-known car brands in the world, including Mercedes, BMW, Audi, Volkswagen and Porsche. The car industry is in an apparent decline and estimates say that half of more than 800,000 jobs will be gone by the year 2030 in the German auto industry. Hit by the coronavirus-induced lockdowns, the new car sales in Germany plummeted by almost 50% year-on-year in the month of May, with new car registrations at just over 168,000 cars. The car sales recovered a bit in June but were still down over 32% June last year. Registering one of the worst performances in three decades for the car industry of Europe's largest economy, that is Germany. The German auto major Daimler has already said that it may cut additional 10,000 jobs under a new cost savings program, while BMW has also revealed its plans to cut 6,000 jobs and slam its brakes on Mercedes self driving alliance. Volkswagen, on the other hand, is also planning to cut 5,000 jobs by transferring production to Poland. The German auto sector jobs are in danger, but, just, but not just because of the global economic slowdown that is threatening the car industry, both in the overseas market as well as the domestic market. The shift from conventional petrol and diesel-powered cars to electric cars is also putting pressure on the auto sector jobs. Electric cars require around six times fewer parts than a combustion engine, and as a result, it needs less workers to assemble an electric car.